Bunk. The Iron Man, as you saw just a minute ago, has gone one by one through every man who betrayed him in the cage match. Through Tuck John Jellick, through Omar Akbar, through Ali Akbar, through Ben Hameen, and the one man who has been avoiding him week after week has been Pat Buck, a.k.a. now D-Buck, but the man who he has wanted to get his hands on, who just points to the home of OVW, is none other than the Iron Man, Rob Conway. Thank you, pointed out. He went through a lot of them, but he ain't gone through Pat Buck. He's going to have to prove that tonight. His opponent, 236 pounds from New Albany, Indiana, the Iron Man, Rob Conway. Ray Ramsey calling for the bell, you're of TV main event, and we are gone, ladies and gentlemen. The fists are flying. This is all about everything that's been happening for the last month, month and a half to the Iron Man, Rob Conway. He's been brewing, he's been stewing, and he's been waiting to get his hands on Pat Buck. Well, I don't particularly like the way he went to get there. He, see, he started just messing with people that had nothing to do with their problems. Kirk John, Omar, Ali, They had everything ben to do with it. They were innocent bystanders. His problem was with Pat Buck, and that's who he should have settled up with like a man. But oh no, he had to go make an example out of everybody else. I'm just saying every member of a gang that's involved in the gang fights, just a, a, an idle member. Every one of those guys took it to the Iron Man, Rob Conway, and he was not gonna forget it anytime soon. Rob Conway reminds me of the Guns, Glory, and God group. He, he picked on everybody except for the one he needed to be settling up with. His problem was with Buck, so now he's got the abs. I imagine he does have Buck thinking after he single-handedly took care of the, of the rest of the insurgency. But well, let's see if he's quite as bad against Pat Buck tonight. I don't think he will be. Well, right now, Iron Man Rob Conway is not giving the Buck a second to breathe. One chop after another from the Iron Man Rob Conway. And keep in mind, ladies and gentlemen, Falls County anywhere, senior referee Ray Ramsey following these two, and the buck looks like he's heading for the hills. But the Iron Man, Rob Conway, is in hot pursuit right here in front of the television desk. Oh man, what a fist for the Iron Man, and they've disappeared through the curtain. No, no, not quite. The Falls County anywhere, Dean. It can happen in there, it can happen out in the parking lot. They can be up in the seat, they can be over here on the desk. Buck was trying to go for the Ow. parking lot, but Conway caught him halfway out the door. I heard puts that. his forehead into the steel reinforcement frame. Owen Buck takes an opportunity to put an elbow into the chest of the Iron Man. If Pat Buck is smart, he's got a vehicle running outside, waiting for him outside that door. This might be more of a dangerous match than he wants to be involved in. Oh, Conway will let this thing go. And the Iron Man kicks out. I mean, we got a new president. Indiana's now a blue state. Look out! Come on! As the buck just puts Iron Man Rob's Rob Con Conway's head into the television desk. Look out! Oh, and oh, it was Buck! Debbie, our producer, our production assistant. Oh, oh man! But the Iron Man saw it coming and returned the favor for the production assistant Dean, as Pat he Buck. put the chest and the kick into the chair. Here's the cover one. Two, Buck kicks out. He pushed her right out of that chair, Dean. I didn't even think Pat Buck could go there. Hopefully she's okay right now. She's not looking focus. okay. Ray Ramsey checking in on her, apparently okay, but our focus still has to be on what's happening in front of you, ladies and gentlemen. Might it's been brewing for too long. That poor girl. The Iron Man Rob Conway and the Buck, and the Iron Man right now has the advantage as Buck is crawling, just trying to get back up to his feet. Well, I tell you what, I'm, I can understand having personal differences between these two, but hitting an un, uh, a poor production assistant out here that had nothing to do with the match. I got a problem with that. What excitement Sick. we've got going on here, ladies and gentlemen. The cover, one, two, the two count. Taking up, I've just been handed something, ladies and gentlemen, I'll read to you here in a little bit of return of an OVW alumni. I'll mention that before we get off the air. Oh, big boot, big knee, another running knee. Another one into the chest of the Iron Man, Rob Conway from D. Buck. Well, I said earlier that Pat Buck was going to have his opportunity to finally settle up with Conway once and for all. Maybe he just got caught up hold in the it, moment. Hold it, Buck has grabbed it. What is he doing? He's grabbed Cornbread's camera. What in the world? What is he doing? Oh, man, he just put the camera into the forehead. Well, there, there's the an angle. Area. There's an angle you don't normally get. Well, that camera's probably no good any longer. Well, Buck right now with the advantage. Hooks the far leg. One, two, 
Oh, the two count. It was. It was a three. It was a two count. He almost had him, but these new high definition cameras are they're made of amazing quality. They, these days, Dean. Well, if that was high definition you on your TV show at home, ladies and gentlemen, you just saw the eyeball of Iron Man Rob Conway come into your living room. 1080p, baby. 1080p. Right now, the block with the advantage, trying to cut off the blood and the outflow to the brain of the Iron Man. The Iron Man rotates towards the hole, gets back up to his feet. You know what? May maybe Pat Buck was just so caught up in it. He didn't even realize that was a girl in that chair. He just he was just caught up in the moment and he, and he wanted the chair. Maybe I shouldn't be so hard on the guy. Both these men right now are staggered. The Iron Man with a slight advantage, but you can't tell it by the look of the Iron Man. She did kind of get in the way. And the Buck, oh, quickly. The Buck sees the opportunity, grabs the headlock on the Iron Man. Rob Conway again trying to cut off the airflow and the blood flow to the brain of the Iron Man. I, I bet if he had the opportunity right now, he would send his condolences back to Beulah and, and apologize to him. Another big fist to the face of the Iron Man, Rob Conway. I don't think he's going to say any apologies to Rob Conway. Not worried about apologizing or anything right now. These two guys have been waiting for better than a month to get their hands on each other. I should say the Iron Man's been waiting. The Buck has been hiding every place he could hide until I he finally could stand it. He couldn't stand it anymore. The uh, Iron Man was so into the into the Buck's head that the Buck just decided to cut to now, the chase. Now here I got hot at him for, for kicking over the production assistant. And, but now you label him as a coward and said he was hiding. I don't think he was hiding. He was strategically placing himself in the right place at the right time for the right match. Oh, Look the here. two. That's right almost over. That arm falls again. Buck wins this. Oh, go. Iron Man not going to have it. As he has to pull from the depths of going to sleep, the Iron Man is finding his way back to consciousness. Pat Buck just needs to cinch that thing up a little tighter, put him back out. Buck jumps up on top, trying to trying to stitch that hold in, trying to cut off the airflow and the blood flow again. But however, the Iron Man works his way back into the corner. Buck still staying on top of the Iron there Man. There you go, hang with it, Pat. Again, the Iron Man driving Pat Buck into the corner. Buck works his way out, comes back again from behind. See, we still do not know what has exactly happened to cause these two to hate each other so bad, to cause Pat Buck to want to go to the places he's gone to with it. How quickly do we forget that cage match, Bowling? My goodness, oh! Over the top, keep in mind, false what count I'm anyway, ladies and gentlemen. That, 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 that led to something. He, he turned on him for a reason. We don't know what those reasons are. I remember the cage match. I was here carrying well, those your- Those are your reasons. I was here carrying your butt as normal. Hold on, I mean, oh, what a running clothesline. On the buck, puts the uh, second one on Pat Buck. Puts him down. False count anyway. Oh, you're counting. A oh. couple of elbows That's right, from the Buck. That's right. Oh, and it's a Gary from Buck on the Iron Man and staggers the Iron Man. This may be the opportunity that you see the American flag waving in the background. The Iron Man trying to get back up to his feet. There you go. Pat Buck looking pretty confident right now. The crowd offering inspiration. Damn. Buck comes off double lock channel across the, the head of the Iron Man. The people waving the American flag are screaming, come on, Rob, come on, Rob. Oh, and down and goes the Iron Man. Good thing I'm getting one, two, and then kicks out. Nothing but concrete under about an inch of padding there. Believe me, it don't do much good. Buck follows all over, but the climb of the Iron Man kicks out again, showing the heart of the Iron Man, Rob Conway. The crowd is getting loud. Buck is wasting his time, jaw jacking with the people here on the front row. Well, Conway apparently has a large contingency of fat women that support him. Oh, Buck, for some reason, is climbed up. Sticking her nose in the match. He's climbed into the, uh, into the crowd here. Oh, and he's grabbed the American flag and gets away from one of our fine faithful. Oh, and throws the flag on the ground. Despicable act. Here we go. This could be it for Conway. Buck climbs and comes off. The Iron Man comes off oh, the flag. Conway used that flag as a weapon. That dirty SOB. He puts the flag up off the ground. The American flag should never touch the ground, ladies and gentlemen. The crowd of Davis Arena, USA, USA. Well, it should never be planted up against the head of Pat Buck either. You want to get technical about it? Oh, oh, is he no, saying? No, it's like the ego trip. The ego trip no, is this one, one, two. two. What the help of the American flag? You're winning, ladies and gentlemen, the Iron Man!